What's up everybody, it's your boy Crazy Kyle, the Filipino picker. And today, we're here at Casa Gianan, where we're gonna show you this massive collection of masks. You've seen this on episodes of KMJS, History Channel, CNN, and a lot more. But today, Crazy Kyle will give you a quick tour of Casa Gianan, the wall of masks. In the civilized world, we have considered masks as a symbol of unmasking someone, like exposing their secrets. But we have forgotten that masks were once a very important part of our culture, used for ritual dances and most definitely a huge part of religious and social life of our ancestors. But for today, let's talk about the art of collecting masks. Before we do anything else, don't forget to click the subscribe button because we upload our new pics on a regular basis like the Harrison Plaza signage, the red payphone, stuff with Ed Kalua, the Halili beer, vintage toys, and collectibles. So let's travel back in time with Crazy Cal TV, the Filipino Picker Edition. Etong isang to hindi ko makalimutan kasi we were in Thailand and we were riding a tuk-tuk tapos na scam pa kami. Somewhere along the way, they offered us something, and the scam kami. Buti na lang we got out of it. And right after that, since hindi naman nakuha yung pera namin, we decided to go shopping and in celebration. And this is one of the things I bought: this mask, wooden mask from Thailand. This one I got in Taiwan, sa airport ng Taiwan, uh, on my way to Los Angeles. Got this. And this one in Indonesia. Ayan, uh, nakalagay made in Indonesia. Ayan. And this one, one of my favorites. Nakuha ko ito sa Intramuros. In one of my trips there. This one's Thailand. Oops. Sabi nila bawal daw yung nagtuturo ng mga masks so, or mga antiques. So, kailangan daw kagatin mo yung daliri mo. This one naman given to me by the family of uh, Outlaw of Microphone Themes. They live in Canada. And uh, this one is uh, made in Italy, no? So, yung mga mas na ganito, uh, sikat sa um, Italy as uh, souvenir items. My mother-in-law also gave me two smaller versions. I'm pretty sure it's also from Italy. She works in Greece. This one is one of my favorites kasi nakaukit dito sa ulo nung tao is yung musika, no? Kasi yung gumawa nito, alam niya na ako yung isang musician, rapper. So he made this for me, sabi niya, to Kyle from Nemi Kadawas. Paete 2013. Ito lang ang binili ko sa kanya. Sabi ko, gawan mo naman ako ng isa na may pangalan ko. So nilagay niya Kyle. Tapos nilagay niya, ayan, from Nemi Kadawas, Paete 2013. At syempre, sa bawat collection, hindi mawawala yung may paborito ka. So here are my top 3 favorite masks. So my first favorite is of course, yung paborito kong movie. Yun yung kay Hannibal Lecter. Let me help you now and I will trust you when it is all over. If you remember yung hinarap siya kay senator, yung babaeng senator na nakidnap yung uh, daughter niya, ito yung suit niya. One of the most chilling moments of Silence of the Lambs. Ito sa mga followers ko. Kung napanood nyo lahat ng mga vlogs ko, mga appearances ko sa GMA, malalaman nyo kung saang episode ito sa Real Time Pinoy Pickers. I think that's um, Pinoy Pickers Volume 1. Volume 1 yan. Yung Volume 2, uh, naglago na tayo. Eh. Pero that one, we got this from um, Sampalok. Um, ito yung ugat, no? isang buo siya. Napakaganda. This one, hindi siya kahoy bakal. Really nice. Of course, um, hindi pwedeng magkaroon ng mask collection ng walang nakangiti at nakasimangot, smiling, and sad face. 
And this one naman, ito yung sad, ito yung happy, at ito yung oh my fucking god! This one naman given to me by my mom. Kasi hindi ako mahirap regaluhan pag mga Christmas, birthday, mask lang, okay na ako. Is this one goes with this set. And I believe this set also, yeah. Kasama ito sa set. Yan, yan. Yan, dalawang yan. Saka this one. Very nice look. Check this out. Yeah. So this one was shipped all the way from the United States. Um, hindi to gawa-gawa lang sa Pilipinas. It's made out of resin. And it's patterned from the original mask ni Hannibal Lecter. My second favorite mask is this one. If you follow my page, malamang nakita nyo na nasuot ko to. And when I take pictures, uh, when I got the four Halili bottles, I use this. And every time I have a very nice item, usually I wear this when I take photos. But now you'll see it on video. I got this from History Con, the History Channel Convention. And ang napakaganda dito sa isang to, ito ay gawang Pinoy. So, gawang Noy pi siya, hindi siya nabili sa eBay or anything. It's real leather and napakaganda niya. Of course, ngayong pandemic, hindi pwedeng mawala yung mga KN95 mask. Very important. It's a lifesaver, not just for fashion. This one just for fashion. <laughs> Filipino picker, ayan o. DLSU, repin. Yan, KN95 mask. And of course, dun sa mga, alam mo yung mga naggamit na, na masks, I was able to think of something, nung ECQ, you know, minsan nabobord tayo, I painted it, I hand painted it, you know, you love for family, love for work, love for your wife, so I painted it, so I sold a few of these, and ito na lang yung natira. When I say sold, I mean, I gave it away to someone who wanted it. Well, he gave me a toy in exchange, so technically, it was a sale. Oh, pwede na itax yan sa barter. Ito, napakaganda nito. Heart shape to. Kaya lang mapansin nyo. Naka mighty bond na lang yan. Dito, oh. Parang, nagkaroon siya ng parang luha effect. Kasi nabiyak siya eh. Nabiyak yan, nalaglag. Kasalanan ng... Kaya may biyak siya dyan, no? Diba? Diba? Ito, Marinduque. I remember when I got this, may goma yan dito. Because you can actually wear it. This is for kids. Yun. This one, I saw this in my shoot with History Channel. Actually, um, Jamie Dempsey wanted to give this to me as a gift, but she changed her mind. She gave me something bigger, but I had my heart on this. So after the shoot, kinabukasan, binalikan ko yan. Uh, I got in touch with the owner ng tindahan, and they gave it to me for a pretty good price. At syempre, mask collection nga eh. Meron bang mask collection na wala si Jim Carrey? The mask. Well, this mask is my number one favorite because I love the movie so much. Um, I got this from a collector and I think you can buy this off eBay. Um, if you are a toy collector, you've probably seen one um, in toy shops. So yeah, this one is patterned of the actual mask in the movie. This one given to me by my sister, Mayet. You know, one of my favorites because yung mask may mask tapos mga musical notes pa very creative eto naman yung kasagsagan ng Jabba Walkies era and of course yung Manny Pacquiao no Philippine flag nagkalat ito noon I think they are custom made and nakakuha tayo ng isa nyan and of course hindi kumpleto ang mga mask collection pag walang ati-atihan of course this one yung mga may walis this one I got in Cubao X. Ceramic yan, napakaganda. And this one, here's a monkey. And another monkey. This one with the earrings. 
At isa sa mga pinakapaborito kong mascara ay ito. So when people ask me, bakit ang dami-daming pwedeng i-collecta? Bakit mascara pa? I have several reasons. Number one, I have multiple identities. And you all know, I'm a rap artist, Crazy Kyle. I'm also Kahoy World, Crazy Kyle's Kahoy World Furniture. I'm a businessman. And also, I'm the Filipino picker from History Channel, KMJS. You've seen me. So, napakadami kong identity. So, just like the mask. Iba-ibang maskara ang sinusuot ko bawat araw. And also, minsan, pag sira ulo ako, pag gabi, nandito lang ako, kinakausap ko lang yung mga yan. And one of the best things about masks, no, aside from looking awesome on your walls, is the fact that it displays different kinds of emotions. May nakangiti, may nakasimangot, may nagulat, may nagagalit. So, just like us, sobrang sobrang pasok sa pagkataon natin, especially for Filipino. Like masks from all over the world, kahit saan ako magpunta, uh, kahit sa ang bansa, kahit sa ang show ako mapunta, I make sure I take home masks.